It's time for weather traffic together on the twos. Let's take a live look outside right now in downtown Somerville where we're starting to see that fog bank build here. The low cloud deck has been hanging out, but I've been watching this camera here over the past 45 minutes or so, and we've noticed the visibility beginning to drop. And as we move towards sunrise, that's going to worsen in many cases. Now, right now, for much of Williamsburg County, much of Berkeley County, Upper Charleston County, we're in the in good shape. We've got some decent fog coverage in Georgetown County and also now starting to see that build from the Charleston Metro on up into Dorchester and Colleton counties where visibilities in some places are near zero. Dense fog advisory is in place for the morning commute. We're looking at mid 60s as we head out the door this morning and the fog concerns are being brought about by light wind. Temperatures in the mid 60s and those mid 60 temperatures are touching dew points, which are in the mid 60s, which is why it's so stuffy outside this morning too. Even if you don't have fog, you're going to notice it's a very dewy, very wet morning, and that's because of the higher dew points that are out there. The fog will be with us through the morning hours, should begin to mix out between 8 and 10. Between 10 and noon, we see plenty of sun breaking out, low 80s to mid 80s by the time we get to early to mid afternoon. We keep those mid 80s going to the weekend then a big spike into the low 90s by the middle of next week. There will be a chance for a little bit of rain Saturday, Sunday, Monday. This is not a washout. I know some of the weather apps that are that are using artificial intelligence and raw computer model data trying to paint a very, very wet picture for the entire weekend. Don't buy that. It doesn't understand the little micro scale and meso scale things that happen here in the low country and it's trying to make it too wet. This will mainly be during the afternoon and evening hours and then we should be in good shape for the vast majority of the weekend, but you will have to dodge some showers and thunderstorms at times. Megan, good morning.